قل يتوفاكم ملك الموت الذي وكن بكم ثم إلى ربكم ترجعون بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم سلام الله عليكم ورحمة الله وبركاته brothers and sisters mourners all over the world لله ما أخذ وله ما أعطاه وإن لله وإن إليه راجعون I reach out to you in English simply because I don't want to force myself twice into this. I first of all want to let you know that my family and I are overwhelmed with the amount of tributes arriving here from all over the world since we released the heartbreaking news about Nora's passing. We haven't been able to respond to all of you yet, so please let me apologize for this. Rest assured, we are taking note of all your tributes and it means really a lot of us during these hours and days of agonies, pains and tears. There are three things I want to share with you. First, Nora left Estonia at 7.59 p.m. CET last Monday, peacefully and surrounded by her two elder daughters and myself. At that time, she was already rendered into deep sleep by strong medication after her condition kept worsening throughout the past five days. The last time she woke up and she was able to mumble some meaningful words, we asked her to keep pronouncing the Shahada La ilaha illallah Muhammad Rasulullah and Alhamdulillah she did. Second, Nora was aware that some brothers and sisters out there might be raising the idea of donating on her behalf, for example, a well somewhere in Africa or the like. And we really appreciate this kind of niya. Please, let me emphasize nevertheless that she never liked these kind of ideas too much. Instead, she was asking all of you, keep doing your dua and especially istighfar for her. Third, Nora's passing might come as a surprise to most of you. Yet, Nora and her family lived through the eight last years of her cancer treatment. And, of course, we were well prepared for this ultimate and painful outcome. Therefore, preparation measures were taken and disregarding terrible pains we all suffer at this moment. The family is ready to fight its way forward in the sense Nora intended. Yet we ask you all to keep us in your sincere dua. In accordance with our Islamic rules, I want to call here for anyone to come forward as soon as possible who has got any unsettled claims against Nora. Please feel free to contact me directly. Last but not least, Nora's burial according to the Islamic rite, will take place tomorrow, Thursday afternoon, 1 p.m. in Bern. Due to the corona crisis, we ask those who haven't been personally invited to stay away from the cemetery in order to comply with the Swiss federal emergency regulations. The Islamic Central Council is going to stream the whole ceremony live so that every one of you can still witness Nora on her last journey and offer simultaneous to ah. Words fail to describe how much we miss you, Nora. Allahumma taqabbal minha, Allahumma aghfir laha, kafir anha sayyatiha, wa yassir laha jawab ayna su'al. Allahumma ijma'ana maha fi jannat al-na'im, wa sallillahumma ala sayyidina Muhammad. وعلى آله وصحبه وسلم تسليما كثيرا